Hey everyone, this is Ariel Royalty and we are back for Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep, episode 16. Last time we did... We finished off... This... You can actually see a planet! <laughs> okay. We finished off Deep Space. Did a bit of grinding and sorry for the interruption about the planet. Never really know did that. Then again, how did I miss it? Anyway, we're off to the one of the final worlds we need to go to. Not too many were left for Terra's side. Okay, we're helping out Hook. And as always, we start with a fight. One thing I'm noting about Terra is he trusts the first person he buddy talks to. Until they prove to him that they cannot be trusted. Uh, idiot! I know you can trust people you talk to and all, but... There is such a thing as listening to your heart and your judgement. Okay, I'm not sure it's too bad. And this is the highest difficulty world we've come across, so that's a good sign. Whoa, don't like that move though. Okay, I'm gonna get my hand on Done. That wasn't too difficult. If I desired your assistance, I'd have demanded it. We had the situation under control. Isn't that right, Smee? Oh, yes, Captain, completely. We would have cleaved those fiends to the brisket, we would. Why, I'd have given him a little of this and this. And don't think your efforts mean you'll get a share of me treasure, understand? I'm not after your precious box, Captain. I'm looking for a person. A boy wearing a mask. Ring any bells? No, not a one. Figures. It's me, you blithering barnacle. We're off! We shall leave this place before the light draws them back again. Huh? Hey, hold on. What did you just say about the light? Ah, yes, it's heartbreaking, really. This chest, you see, contains light gathered from all around. And I've got an acquaintance, a boy, who's sure to try and seize it. A boy who's after the light. If it's not Benitas... Then who? Hey, why don't I help you keep the light safe? Maybe you could tell me more about this boy who's troubling you. What's his name? Peter Pan! We are so being used here. And I am a fan of the Peter Pan franchise and the Tinkerbell franchise. I don't care who doesn't like it, tough. This chest must be brought to Skull Rock safely. Don't let that Peter Pan anywhere near it. Right. I got you covered. So yeah. I like Peter Pan and I like Tinkerbell. I don't know how her dress stays up, but I like her. Wish my hair could go in a bun. I guess it can't for some annoying reason. Anyway, as you can assume, we've got to go. Oh, well. Talk of a shop, but I wanted a shop. Okay, I'm gonna buy a bunch of blue of thunders. Um, 
I'll just buy a hundred. I'll grind them off the screen. Two. Into Fundargas and other stuff. I'll do that before we go to the final world of the game. I'll grind everything I need to. Speaking of grinding... me making much sense to some people but let's just say there is a method to my maps <laughs> do when I'm grinding is I buy a bunch of everything I definitely have money I can buy 20 of them damn it I can only buy 14 I'll make do with what I got then Okay, so pretty much when I'm grinding, I just load my command decks up and I go about fighting. And level them up. So that's what I'm going to do and I'm going to explore during this episode, so hope you like. If not, tough. <laughs> if not, then you wouldn't be watching the video, would you? Okay, I found a spot to grind. facing hard enemies. I've got a save point or a shop nearby. Here, 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 here
where that one has disappeared to. Okay. I haven't gone down here yet. Ah, I know this area. I'm gonna make the goon. Payback thing. does not exist. Ooh, hello. How the hell did I see underwater there? But I'll say this. If it does, please let me go there. It looks beautiful in the movies and whatnot. So if it does, it might not exist, but if it does, I would love to go there at some point. But understandably, it might just be a fairy tale. So kind of got to wait until someone says how to get there. Or at least how to fly there. But, hey, we can go there in our dreams. <laughs> I ain't telling you like a total door, can't I? Can't help it. But then again, who wouldn't want to go to Neverland and fly? Some people might want to give Hook a hand. Some people might just want to fly with Tinkerbell. Some people might want to become a Lost Boy. Or go. <coughs> You're mimic. Oh, yes, yes, you are. Take that! I knew that rock could be destroyed, it was just doing so. Why do I keep pressing triangle to jump? I've been playing way too much Elder Scrolls. And I know 
my way around it way too well. Go down there. Keyblade off this. Two slots? That must be powerful. Oh, only now do I get an elixir? Sonic Impact. Did I not equip that? I thought I did. Hmm. Either way, it's equipped now. <laughs> After this world, we'll be going back to the Mirage Arena to clear it out pretty much. I'm not sure what this area is meant to be. I've never seen this area in the movies. Definitely no idea where this is meant to be. Either way, this is where we're going to end off. I'm going to do most of my grinding off screen. <laughs> so I will see you next time when we finish Neverland and return to the Mirage Arena. So until then, take care of yourselves and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>